Super Classic Mind Match Between Duchel and Junior Tierdick Coach Thomas Duchel will face a real baptism of fire as he leads Bayern Munich into a bloody battle with Borussia Dortmund, the club that has made his name. Remember, on the other side of the line, Coach Edin Tierdick is eager to spoil the baptism of the man who has just come to the Grey Lobster. The Way of Dreamers Looking at their resumes, Duchel and Tierdick have a big similarity in being the coach of the two biggest Bundesliga clubs without having to go through a peak playing career. As a player, Duchel had only played eight games for Stuttgart kickers in the Bundesliga 2, while Tierdick had 61 games for an unknown village team. Retiring early at the age of 24, 1998, Duchel soon entered the coaching career and started with Stuttgart's youth team and spent almost a decade learning about youth football, also at Augsburg and Mainz, before became the coach of Mainz in 2009. There, Duchel enjoyed five great years as he led Mainz to the best Bundesliga season in the club's history, finishing fifth in 2010-11. He displayed a tactical acumen that would bring him hot seats at Borussia Dortmund, Paris Saint-Germain, Chelsea, and now Bayern Munich. Tierdick also soon gave up football to pursue a career in sports science and began working as a scout for Dortmund in 2010. He was on the team that helped Dortmund include Robert Lewandowski, Ilke Gundogan, and Marco Reus in the squad. And won silver discs 2010-11 and 2011-12. At that time, Tierdick was only 20 years old. Tierdick began coaching Dortmund's youth team, initially as an assistant coach, and like Duchel, he also spent a decade in various roles such as assistant coach to Slaven Billick at Besiktas and West Ham, before taking charge of Dortmund in December 2020 after Lucien Favre was sacked. The generation still continuous. Duchel arrives at Bayern with a resume full of titles and a great fit for the Bundesliga champions. He has won two Ligue 1 titles, one French National Cup, one League Cup, two French Super Cups with PSG. But Bayern was most impressed with Duchel about how miserable he had been made by Dortmund under him. In the 2015-16 season, Duchel's Dortmund won a whopping 78 points, the second highest in Bundesliga history. Only the mighty Bayern under Pep Guardiola could stop Duchel from winning the silver disc, but Dortmund also managed to beat Bayern in the semi-finals to then win the 2017 German Cup. However, the most valuable victory in Duchel's coaching career was the 2021 Champions League silver trophy with Chelsea, a ticket to the FIFA Club World Cup and European Super Cup titles as well as the title of the best coach in 2021. FIFA Nine years younger than Duchel, Tierdick is a promising opponent for the established master who currently holds Bayern. However, there's no reason why Tierdick's career trajectory shouldn't follow Duchel's illustrious path. He has almost the same score when leading Dortmund, average 2.04 points slash 48 matches compared to 2.09 points slash 68 matches under Duchel. Tierdick's only win so far is the 2021 German Cup. It's small compared to Duchel's gold table, but remember, he won it when he was five years younger than Duchel, 38 to 43. Indeed, Tierdick now has the opportunity to repeat Duchel's feat of winning a national championship after two years of winning the national cup if he wins the 2023 silver disc. A fight of two strategy minds. Duchel is known for his tactical acumen willingness to change formations and quick delivery of potential improvements. His sharp mind has helped him succeed in a coaching role, most notably winning the Champions League with Chelsea just four months after joining in 2021. It is certainly the go-to beer for any Bayern fan, as is the fact that Duchel is comfortable with a four-back or three-back formation. His predecessor Julian Nagel's man was sacked partly unable to solve the difficulties arising in the three-back formation this season. A strong pressing system with the ability to attack quickly often helps Duchel's teams make the most of their quality. If this becomes true, the rest of the Bundesliga this season will be very difficult for Bayern's opponents, especially Dortmund, who are dreaming of excess water, 
stealing the silver disc. Meanwhile, Tyrdik is also receiving many compliments for his creative tactical thinking when he continues to flourish as the head coach of Dortmund. For example, his recent decision to switch Rafael Guerreiro from left back to central midfield has proven to be highly effective as the player has been involved in scoring five times in two games in the Premier League. This mind. In general, Tyrdik always favors a four-back formation and emphasizes the certainty when holding the ball as well as the tendency to tighten the midfield creating many similarities with Tuchel. His tactics were applied flexibly and skillfully to help Dortmund get 10 unbeaten matches from the beginning of 2023 until now. Neuter Class CK or by Thomas Duchel. This weekend, coach Duchel will be in a completely different position in the 8th Der Class CK or game in his career as coach of Bayern Munich, while in the previous 7 games he held Dortmund. Among them, he did not win in 4 Der Class CK or matches and won two of the last three matches. Duchel also failed to face Bayern in the Champions League final 2020 while leading PSG. Tierdick is yet to win in two Der Klasse CK or matches, with a 2-4 loss in March 2021 and a 2-2 draw in October 2022. Dortmund is in extremely high form. After losing four of the first ten games of the season, Dortmund has changed drastically from the winter break. Eight consecutive wins in the Bundesliga from January to March is something that no Dortmund coach has done since Jurgen Klopp. Tierdick has won 28 points out of a possible 30 in the past 10 games. In the last 10 games to lead Chelsea in the Premier League, Duchel has only 17 points.